burning cars and smashed windows. A small group of protesters dressed in black, their faces covered, armed with hammers and bricks. Facing off with thousands of officers on site, many in riot gear, confronting them with flashbang grenades and pepper spray. All of a sudden, the police officers started to spray pepper spray and they got our audio technician. They're coming. They're see us running because they're going to throw more flashbangs. The chaotic scene just blocks outside the secure area of the inauguration and parade route. I personally have anti-establishment slants, but I don't think that this is anything that I want to be a This checkpoint is closed! Before the swearing-in ceremony even began, protesters tried to block checkpoint entrances. During President Trump's speech, several demonstrators were escorted out of the area. Several officers injured during the protest today, and more than 100 people arrested. Once the inaugural parade began, the newly sworn in president facing thousands of peaceful protesters amongst his supporters. NBC's Stephanie Gosk was with him all day. When Donald Trump took the oath of office, the people here sang, We shall overcome. Resist from day one! Similar demonstrations across the country. Arrest outside Trump Tower, New York City. A human chain across San Francisco's Golden Gate Bridge. From Phoenix to Houston to Chicago, people protesting the country's new president on his first day in office. Tonight, thousands of protesters remain in downtown D.C., occasionally facing off with police. We have seen many people injured, both protesters and police officers. And tomorrow, D.C. police are preparing for a women's march on Washington. Organizers of that march say they expect a couple hundred thousand people. Lester? Jacob Rascone here in D.C. tonight. Th hey, NBC News fans, thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Subscribe by clicking on that button down here and click on any of the videos over here to watch the latest interviews, show highlights, and digital exclusives. Thanks for watching.